Good. This is the CBS Evening News. Dan Rather reporting from CBS News Election Headquarters in New York. Announcement today by the U.S. Ambassador to Colombia that a major cocaine factory had been shut down in his country contained what seemed like a record number of superlatives. But any record set in that area was overshadowed by the record set in the drug bust itself. Bob Simon in New York narrates our report. It was the biggest bust anywhere, anytime. 13 tons of cocaine from the jungles of Colombia worth $1.2 billion in the streets of the United States. The Drug Enforcement Agency in Washington called the operation mind-boggling. Airborne Colombian police, accompanied by a U.S. narcotics agent, began the raid 10 days ago. They encountered fierce resistance when they hit the ground. When it was all over, they had 11 bodies to show journalists, and they had arrested 40 people, including an American pilot. They also had documents incriminating officials in the Colombian government. The camp was in the deepest Colombian jungle, 700 miles south of Bogota, and it was a complete community, the Coca community. With five runways equipped for night landings, a power plant, sophisticated communications, a very impressive arsenal, even livestock. The U.S. Embassy says it was all under the protection of the armed wing of the Colombian Communist Party. 13 tons represents 25% of all the cocaine consumed in the United States in one year. In the words of the DEA, it won't affect the street price right away, but it will put a definite crimp in the cocaine supply. Bob Simon, CBS News, New York. March 20th, 1984, from ABC, this is World News Tonight with Peter Jennings. This evening, reporting from Chicago. We learn today about the largest drug bust in history. Last week in Colombia, police and army units raided a jungle hideout. They found 12 and a half tons of cocaine <laughs> with a street value of more than a billion dollars. The army and police fought a day-long battle with the smugglers. Forty of them were arrested. This is NBC Nightly News, reported by Tom Brokaw. Good evening. From the United States Ambassador to Colombia calls it the biggest drug haul in history, a mega bust in the Colombian jungle that yielded nearly 14 tons of cocaine. Street value, $1.2 billion. Colombian police attacked a jungle cocaine processing plant that they said was guarded by communist guerrillas. The plant had 10 labs for processing the cocaine. 40 people were arrested, including an American pilot. The complex is located in a remote area about 700 miles south of Bogota. Under Colombian law, all evidence in a drug raid must be burned. In this case, cocaine, guns, and seven airplanes. The drug crackdown is continuing in that part of the world.